Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to use your iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max as a webcam on your Windows or Mac. Whether you have PC or laptop or Mac, it doesn't really matter. So, if you have Mac, then you have it a little bit easier, of course, because you can go to the settings, and then if you go to general, and then go to AirPlay and continuity, and then you have this option that you can enable and disable for the camera. So, when this is enabled, if you, for instance, open FaceTime on your Mac or something similar like Zoom, anything else, you can just go to the app video menu or settings and then try to find the option to switch the camera to iPhone. Now, on the other hand, if you have issues with this option, if it doesn't work for you, um, or if you have Windows, then in that case, you want to use this one over here. This is the app that I will be using in this example. It is called Arian, you can find it in the App Store and you will also need it uh, on your PC or Mac or um, anything else. Uh, so you want to install it on your, uh, on your iPhone and once you install it, of course, you can open it already. You will see this information that it is waiting for connection and you can actually connect using Wi-Fi or using the USB cable. It's really up to you how you prefer it. Now, if you use Wi-Fi, then you will also need to be connected to the same a Wi-Fi connection, uh, so you need to be in the same network in order to make it work. So now I'm gonna switch to PC. I have Windows in my example, however you can of course also vis visit this website on your Mac. Uh, you go to arian.com uh, and over here you have these download links if you have Windows and of course you click webcam for Windows. If you have Mac then you go and click uh, webcam for Mac. And once you actually download this app, and once you install it, then what you need to do is pretty much run it. You want to open it. You want to have it open all the time. This works like a server for your iPhone. And as you can see, I'm already connected because it says Wi-Fi if I lift my iPhone. And as you can see, there is my hand. It works just fine. And there are no issues at all. Over here on the left side, you can tap on these three lines in order to choose the video format. It is set automatic. However, you can use, for instance, the full HD resolution, as I don't think most of the time you don't need more than that. And of course, um, like I said, you can use Wi-Fi and USB. So if you don't have the USB connection, so I'm going to actually switch to the device. Let's close that. And I'm going to turn off Wi-Fi just to showcase how it works. So I'm going to use the USB cable that I have over here and I'm going to connect my iPhone to my PC. There we go. And while using the USB, all you need to do is pretty much reopen the, uh, the app. The camera is already working. There is no information that we are waiting for the connection because I'm already connected. And this time, as you can see, it says USB. So you don't really need to press anything, change anything. It is really simple as that. And now in order to use it, whether you use, for instance, OBS or Zoom or Microsoft Teams, whatever, you just need to simply choose the source of the video or of the image. Um, you need to choose Irian. So it's pretty much, that's pretty much all you need to do. And that's, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.